Hello, my friends. It's me again, your favorite dentureware. Sure hope everybody's doing okay today. I had an amazing night's sleep last night. I went to bed at 10 o'clock. I normally don't go to bed until 12 or 1 o'clock. I went to bed at 10 o'clock. I did not wake up till 8 o'clock this morning. I feel amazing. Yesterday was my first day taking my thyroid medicine. This stuff right here. Uh, where is it? There it is. This this stuff right here. Yesterday was my first day taking that. I take that first thing in the morning. And I can't eat or drink anything for at least a half an hour. Except water. Uh, which is fine with me, I guess. Not a big fan of water. <laughs> but then I have to take this uh, powder stuff. Um, I mix it in juice. And... Um, so a half an hour after I take the thyroid pill, I have to mix one of these in four ounces of juice and drink it. And that stuff is nasty. It doesn't dissolve. Okay? It doesn't dissolve at all. It's, I tried it in water and it made like, it's just like drinking dirt in water. It, it tastes nasty and it just, it's like, it feels like you're drinking dirt. Um, if I put it in orange juice, it's supposed to be orange flavored. It's not really. Um, but if I put it in orange juice with pulp in it, <coughs> real orange juice, not the fake crap, then it kind of simulates the pulp. So I can handle that. I can drink that down pretty rapidly. And I can handle that because the, the grit in it kind of simulates the pulp in your orange juice, which is awesome much better for me to handle it that way last night I slept all night long didn't wake up once didn't have to run to the bathroom a single time here's the amazing part I started this treatment yesterday morning okay night before last I was in the bathroom all night long I took my thyroid pill yesterday morning and I took a powder I ate three full meals yesterday which is unusual for me I'm used to eating one meal a day um, I ate three full meals yesterday and slept all night long and didn't have to use the restroom till this morning because my colon my small intestines and my stomach were empty because of the issues I've been having, I haven't been able to retain anything. Everything has to process through your small intestine. That's your digestive system. Yes, your stomach helps break down the food and send it into the small intestine. But the reason your small intestine is so long, I mean, it's miles long, is because it, it as the food goes through the small intestine, all them little curves and stuff in the small intestine it breaks it down it absorbs the nutrients out of it if you're not keeping anything in your small intestine you're not absorbing any nutrients so that's been my issue this whole time I put food in my stomach it goes straight through in a matter of minutes so I wasn't able to retain anything being able to eat three times yesterday and retain all that food and absorb the nutrients out of it and sleep a full night which is great for the brain but just being able to get a full night's sleep and I can already feel the difference in my energy level and my concentration level and things like that because not just because I slept for a full night but because I'm starting to get nutrients again I'm not starving anymore um, the bloating should go away in a matter of, you know, in, in a short amount of time. Um, with my body mass index being 22.5, uh, with my height and weight and everything else, I should be between 15 and 25 is what the doctor said. So I'm, I'm right at 22.5, which is excellent for my height and weight and build and all of that. And... So this bloating that I have, that I, I'm, I, was, I started losing weight, but my stomach was getting bigger. 
and the reason my stomach was getting bigger was because I was starving. So, um, yeah, so the bloating should subside, and I should get back to my standard flat stomach self, which will be awesome. Uh, I already feel amazing. I can't wait to see after a few days. The issue is now, um, today's Thursday. Yesterday was Wednesday. Today's Thursday. Um, I was regulated yesterday. I was, I'll be regular today. I'll be regular Friday. And then Saturday, I have to drink all that damn juice, or Sunday, I have to drink all that stupid juice to go in for my colonoscopy on Monday. So I have to completely empty out my system again. And then after that, I'm going to load up on foods again and try to rebuild that so I can have that in my system again and, and get regular again. But, uh, you know, I need to go in for the colonoscopy anyway. I'm 51 years old. I've never had one done. I don't think they'll find anything. I'm sure it'll come up negative. But it needs to be done anyway. So, And then you're supposed to have one every seven years, so I'll just start planning on that. Um, but for now, I feel amazing. I feel great. I feel fantastic. I just wanted to update everybody on that. Um, it's It's been too long. If you have stomach issues, if you have diarrhea and it lasts for more than 10 days, um, you know, the flu can last 10 days. You can have diarrhea for 10 days with a stomach flu. Uh, but if it lasts longer than that, go to a doctor. Don't wait four and a half months like I did. Use me as a lesson. Get to the doctor. Get it taken care of. It might be something really simple or not, but you need to find out. Hope everybody has a fantastic day. Keep smiling, keep trying, and never give up.